Mary. I'd better get back to the mission. Yes, our window of opportunity won't last forever. Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. Wish I could let them out, but it's for their own safety, I guess. That should be for acting. Acting like I cared about the stupid missions on this ship. Hey, the helmet comes off. Ah, my first hazard suit. Kept out Omicron radiation and kept in diaper leaks. How did I manage to win second place that time? I think that's the ratty old washcloth I used to drag around the spaceship. I really hope she washed that thing. As soon as we get full control of this ship, I'm going to burn this stuff. I gave up making art years ago, and if no one's around to see it, who cares? I wonder what's in those creepy jars. My old teeth? Hair? I made a hexipal out of a paper plate. Probably thought they were alive then. She bronzed my first space shoes. Or was that the remains of my old bomb squad bot? I wish she'd get rid of these. My paper mache is so much better than that now. Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? <laughs> hey, my... My head. What's wrong? My head is smaller. Oh, uh, yeah, you just used a teleporter. Why did my head shrink? Quantum physics. Duh. Don't worry, it'll all go back to normal when you take the trip back through me. Big baby. Teleporter, activate. This way to the fusion ore containment facility. Here we go! Okay, now my head is just getting ridiculous. Oh boy, you went through two teleporters without a return trip, didn't you? You're playing with fire, kid! Caution! Entering an area of strong Omicron radiation levels. Full radiation shielding necessary to proceed. Lay it on me. Thank you. Goodbye. Hey, where's my helmet? That's just great. My head is almost small enough to fit in this helmet now. My head is almost small enough to fit in this helmet now. I'm not getting any closer to that fusion orb without my radiation helmet. Boiling my brain is not the kind of danger I'm looking for. Activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? Here we go! See you. Teleporter, activate. To the starboard passageway, sir. Not responsible for lost items, motion sickness, or mutations. Remember to come back through the way you came to avoid dangerous cranial alterations. Warning. Objects placed into this trash chute will be jettisoned from the ship. And the next time it happens to one of your toys, Shay, your father is not going to retrieve it for you. Huh. You crawl into something once when you're two years old and they lock it forever.
Oh no, don't even think it. What? You are banned from this rail for life, young man. Life! Your passengers are still in grief counseling. Please leave before they see you. Can't I ride the train again? Banned for life. Nah, Gary doesn't want to grab that. Missions are cancelled. You can drop the act. It's not an act! I think I pulled a muscle in that last attack you gave me! My back is killing me! Hey, I didn't attack you. You guys attacked me. Hey, can we run the attack mission protocol? Didn't you hear me? I'm in pain! Perfect. You can use it in your acting. Leave me alone! Hey, maybe I can fix your back. Really? Yeah, I think I see what's wrong. Hold still. Ah. Ah. Yes! That feels amazing! You're welcome. Now can we run the attack mission protocol? Sure, buddy! I owe you one! Hey, wake up. There? Was? Yeah, yeah. Let's get this over with. No, I just... <laughs> Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? Not responsible for lost items, motion sickness, or mutations. Come again. Son, I'm not sure it's safe enough for you to leave your room. I'm tired of being a prisoner in my room. I'm sick of being a prisoner on this ship. I know, son. I know it's hard. You've given up so much. Listen, I'd like to tell you a story. A story of another person your age. A young girl. She wanted to live a normal life, but she was chosen. She was honored with a special duty. Some people would call it a sacrifice, but what she didn't realize at the time was that it was a great honor. Please. I've heard the story of the Sacrifice Girl a million times. I know the ending. The Sacrifice Girl is you, right? What I'm trying to tell you is that... I made a hard choice, but I regret nothing because... Great story, computer. I'm sorry they programmed you with someone's sad memories, but I have to go. You know the truth deep down, son. And I know you'll appreciate my words someday. Uh-huh. Brother. Yes, my love. Computer, were you aware that the universe was at war? 
and that helpless creatures are being terrorized by ruthless tyrants? Ooh, that sounds like a fun new game. I'll talk to the Yarn Pals and get that set up for the next round of missions. Would you like that? <sighs> Never mind. Computer, what's the point of all this? Son, you know how important Operation Dandelion is. Our home, Laruna, was dying, so we set sail on the Bassa Nostra to travel the universe and find you a new home. Why haven't we found a new home yet? Well, the universe is a big place, and it has to be perfect for my baby. Computer, we need to get to Prima Doom immediately. Absolutely not. They call it Prima Doom for a reason. Why not have some fun in the smile system instead? Is there anybody else on this ship? It's just you, me, and your father, of course. Oh, are you feeling lonely? I could meet you some new friends. So, you've never seen a strange wolf around? Son, I can't keep track of all your yarn pals. Oh, are you saying you'd like a little wolf friend? Well, I've never knit a wolf before, but it should be no problem. So what does Dad do during the day? Oh, your father has a lot of work to do outside, you know? Fixing the hull, scraping off space parasites, keeping a lookout for new planets to live on. Well, I gotta get back to taking over the ship. <laughs> oh, sweetie, you're so funny. Candy and treats are all you can eat 24-7. They just aren't that appetizing anymore. Oh, this kid's got some real tough problems! Hey guys. I suppose you want to run the Nope, I just wanted to see what you guys were up to. Not much. You know, just chillin'. <laughs> He's been waiting for you to ask that for a long time. It's a whipped cream gum. And it's mine. Do we really need all that whipped cream? Yeah, to keep you away from the ice cream up there. She'd leave something this dangerous lying around. What's that? Nothing. 
You don't talk too, do you? Not unless I have something to say. Please ignore him, sir. Bad attitude. Emergency rations? I think that's overreacting. Not going back in there if I can help it. Why am I wasting time in this kitchen when I could be out in space? Hey, why won't this open? Oh, honey, you can't come in here. I'm working on a surprise for you. What is it? Nice try. Warning, airlock ahead, safety suit and air tether required for extravehicular exploration. But don't worry, I'll put it on you, sweetie pie. Ugh. Let's see if this fits. Come on. 
That's the stuff. Here we go! Open up. But this time, take it easy. I'm free! In space! Okay. Now what? Something tells me the Boomar manual controls are nearby. Those must be the manual controls for the boom arms. Maybe if I could get this hatch open. No good. Stupid fat hands. Actually, I'll need something even thinner than that if I'm going to pry that thing open. Let me try to... Oh, hey! Uh oh No, no not the face! Or the neck! Or the body! I'm free! Free to cleave the infinite void of space itself! Phew! That's a relief for a lot of reasons. I think... I think Gary wants to grab that. Okay, grabbing Gary. It's hero time. Don't be scared. Well, go ahead. Grab the controls. Oh, yeah, I have the button. Engage! Good boy! Oh, hey, 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 hey! That's enough, Gary. We don't want to attract attention just yet. You sit tight here, and I'll push the button again when it's go time, okay? Goodbye, Gary! You were the best present ever! Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? <laughs> Come again. Teleporter, activate. This way to the Fusion Orb Containment Facility. Hang on! 
I think that's all my head can take. You need to make a return trip through me right away, Shay. In a minute. Caution. Entering an area of strong Omicron radiation levels. Full radiation shielding necessary to proceed. I think this machine is just never going to give me a helmet. What a ripoff. A little snug, but I think it will work. I'm not sure how long I can stand the spoiled milk smell, though. ship shields, which is critical, because we get attacked by enemy spaceships constantly. This is Merrick's defibrillator. Inhibitor? Right. And I need to put it on the confusion ball. Confusion orb? Uh, wait, are you doing this on purpose? <laughs> Easy does it. There. Fusion orb. Inhibited. Not quite. We won't activate the Omicron inhibitor until we're ready to take the shields down. And when will we be ready? As soon as you get this ship to Prima Doom. Check. Teleporter, activate. May I teleport you to the Nexus? Hang on! Ow, 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 ow! Ow! Oh! Head normalization expedited. You're welcome. I hate quantum physics. Oh no. It turns out that whole head shrinking thing was just faulty wiring. One more trip and that head would pop right off. <laughs> so again, you're welcome. We need to go here right away. Prima Doom! Negative. That system is forbidden due to likelihood of hostile activity. But it's an emergency. Sometimes safety is the most exciting adventure of all. Might I suggest somewhere safer, like Puppy Planetoid, Cozy Cluster, or maybe somewhere in the Smile system? Where shall we go today, wise commander? No way. I have to go to Prima Doom right now. Lives depend on it. I'm sorry, young master, but my programming won't allow it. Maybe the smile system would be better. Mechanism. Make it so. And we're here. Please enjoy your stay and be safe. Where shall we go today, wise commander? Fine. Cozy cluster it is. Preparing decryption mechanism. 
Initializing warp Looks like the Space Weaver has encoded the star chart. This is the star chart for Prima Dune. Weave thrusters at viscosity. Spindle at rotational velocity. Big improvement. Deploying nav star I think it would look five. better this way. Let me just make one small Four. change here. Three. Two. One. the destination I indicated. I'm so sorry, young master. I will correct this right. What's that? I seem to be out of yarn. Humiliation! 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 Wow. He took that really hard. Don't worry, Space Weaver. As soon as I rescue those helpless creatures, we'll get out of Prima Doom. Cop over here. We're all set for the rescue mission, but enemy forces seem to be aware of us already. I'm ready. Let's do this quickly. Affirmative. The controls are yours. You may now use the fusion orb inhibitor button to inhibit the fusion orb and shut down the ship's shields. And your remote control for that children's toy. Grabbing Gary. Yes. You may now press it to activate Grabbing Gary. And thereby the ship's boom arms. Got it. Dang. Rats. Well done. Now the next one. Wait for it. Keep trying. Okay, that's all we can do. We're pulling out. No! I need to save this last one. Don't make the same mistake you did last time, boy. You said you trusted my instincts, right? I... I don't understand. What is it about this creature? I don't know, but it's important. There is no need for this. We've saved more than enough. It's not worth the risk, boy. It's just one creature. Dang. Rats. Dang. Rats. Dang. Got her! Huh? What's that? I... I have no idea. Evasive maneuvers! Attention! Ship is under attack! I can't see her anymore! Forget about the creature! We need to move you to a safe location! Come with me! Yes! Merrick! Run, Shay! Get somewhere safe! Attention! Critical breach in outer hall! I can fix this! No! Shay, there you are. Something has happened to the ship, but don't worry. Your father's gone out to fix it. Shay, where are you going? It's not safe. Shay! 